The Catholic Church is sending a strong message against racism. In the Diocese of Brooklyn, the sin is being fought off with love. If the church loves and encourages others to love each other, then we deal with the basic issue. Father Bill Smith, the pastor of St. Charles Borromeo in Brooklyn Heights, is leading by example, encouraging his parishioners to address racism by talking about their experiences. We become human by community and by building up and strengthening relationships. Who else can do that but the church? We have this obligation to, to pray for our community and our country and our world. And Recently following a Zoom prayer service, parishioners listened to the experiences of one of their own. I respect the police and everything, but I would be lying to you if I've had interactions with the police where I knew if my skin color was different, it would not happen. Tevin Williams is a new Catholic and a new New Yorker. He was confirmed last year and recently put down roots in the city after leaving the South. The loving piece, right, of me being a Catholic and, and talking and having these conversations with my fellow brothers and sisters in Christ, um, that is something I cannot say I've really seen in the South. Tevin says thanks to his parish community, he's better able to cope with the racial unrest sweeping the nation. I'm thankful that I am a Catholic right now. It is God's will that I'm here in this parish and having these conversations and enlightening some people and telling them my experience. Tevin said Father Bill is the kind of leader every parish needs, allowing for a safe space to discuss hard truths about race and overcome each other's differences. I hope that we can come together as Catholics and understand um, that we may be different in skin tone, but we are all bound by one heart, but we also understand the reality once groups are allowed to gather or get in church, Father Bill said he plans to organize a town hall meeting open to all parishioners to discuss racism and how the church can continue to be an ally in the fight against it. Christine? Jess, how can we as Catholics be allies? In Tevin's interview on that Zoom service, he told people the first way everyone can do something is by speaking out, calling out racial injustices when you see them. And he also suggested that Catholic what we do best, volunteer, help out in the community, and promote love whenever we can. Jessica, thank you so much. If you're watching Currents News on YouTube, be sure to hit the subscribe button and then click on the bell to get instant updates about all of our newest content because we are putting your faith in the news.